the whistle has gone, and Huddersfield Town are heading to Wembley in the playoff final. Jordan, the perfect night. It is really, yeah. Um, you know, there weren't much in the game, weren't much between the two teams Friday night, Monday night. It was just that little roll of the ball, but these are games and nights that live long in the memory until the day you die. And um, the fact that we've come through the other side unscathed and give ourselves a chance of going to Wembley, it's, it's a special night. And when you came back here in the summer, did you think this was possible? You always dream about these special occasions, you know, when you're running on the roads pre-season and you're getting yourself right, you think about getting yourself in a position, special nights where you can have an impact and things, and you dream about it all day long, but when it becomes a reality, it takes your breath away. You've been in some dressing rooms, some successful dressing rooms. What's the secret about this one? Just a real honest, great bunch of lads. Um, really, really good players, but even better people. Um, I've said that all season long. We go, to, we go to Wembley now with a chance, and that's what we've given ourselves also, all, all season. We've, we've just put ourselves in, uh, in games where we've given ourselves a chance, and now we find ourselves going all the way down there with the fans backing behind us and who knows what 90 minutes will bring. And your manager really instills that belief in you, doesn't he? Yeah, yeah, I think the whole club does. Um, you know, people, backroom staff, coaching staff, non-playing staff. It's a real collective effort and, um, you know, it'd be, it'd be great to, uh, to get over the line just for them. And to be able to celebrate with the fans after playing for a year without supporters, it makes it even more sweeter, doesn't it? Absolutely, yeah, with COVID and everything that happened as well. It's, um, these fans deserve that, you know, and... You know, the, after COVID and staying away and the troubles that have been, yeah, these times are special. The whole of Huddersfield's heading down Wembley Way, that'll be a special occasion, won't it? Yeah, it will, yeah. Um, and like we said, we've, we've put ourselves in a chance now, uh, put ourselves in a position where we're 90 minutes away, who knows what, who will play um, come that day, but yeah, we've given ourselves a, a chance at it. So um, we'll dust ourselves down, enjoy these next couple of days, but then the focus will be on, on that trip down on that Sunday afternoon.
Amazing, absolute fantastic. I think it's nothing less than this team deserves. We've been wrote off from day one. We've dug in, we've grind results, we've uh, put ourselves in a fantastic position now. And I say outside the club, you surprised a few people, but in the dressing room, there's been some real belief, hasn't there? Oh, the dressing room is unbelievable. It's, it's second to none, everything. The character, the personalities, and uh, a top class and a work rate alongside that is, it makes a uh, special team. A terrific game with two great sides. You went toe to toe all the way to the end, didn't you? Yeah, we did. Listen, it was a tight game. Luton are a good team. Uh, they wouldn't be where they were in the league if they weren't. So we had to dig in, we had to grind it. And luckily, the, the luck was on our side tonight. And one game away from the Premier League. A uh, tough game coming up against whoever it may be. Oh, it, it doesn't matter. We're there. We can, um, we can, we can be proud of ourselves. And um, as long as they're there, we've always got a chance. And be able to celebrate this with the fans last year without them for the whole season. 
And being able to celebrate with all these people, it must make it even more memorable, yeah? The fans here are unbelievable. You, you can see they come in the numbers, they get behind the lads, the supporters every week, and I'm just so happy for them as much as the team. Plans to celebrate tonight? Ah, uh, well, we keep that quiet. <laughs> I mean, it shows the grit that we've got, the team spirit. I mean, Luton, probably the better side tonight. We were nowhere near our best, but like always, we stuck together and we know that we're going we're gonna to get chances and with players like Jod, that's what, that's, that's what he does. So we're going to enjoy tonight and then work hard for the final. I say that courage, that persistence, you've shown that all season and again tonight. Yeah, I mean, in the first leg, we we seen them get tired. Um, Tonight, I don't think they did. Um, we, we were expecting to, to grow into the game after our time and, and they'd have some tired legs, but like I say, I think Luton were really good tonight. Um, Lee makes an unbelievable save in the first half. Um, but like I say, the team spirit within these boys is, is incredible and, and we stick together right to the end. Special season in the dressing room. It's a special group, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, it gets said a lot, but this is the best group I've been involved in. Um, hands down by Kutcher Mile. I love every single one of them. We've got one more huge game. But like I say, we'll enjoy tonight and, and go again. Big John! Hey! hey! And to be able to celebrate with this with the fans, that must make it even more sweeter. Yeah, I mean, definitely. They deserve it. They've been with us all season. Stuck with us through thick and thin. Um, and for me, coming through at this club to, to play at Wembley in the final to, for a chance in the Premier League, it's a dream come true. I mean, I love this place. I mean, come on. Hey!